Hey guys, I hope you're all well. Today I'm going to do an output of the evening video. Um, I'm, it is really dark here in the UK now because the clocks haven't even gone back yet. It's 10 to 7 and it's pitch black outside and I'm filming on my iMac. Um, so the lighting may be a bit iffy but I thought I would film this outfit of the evening because I'm going out to drinks with um, my best friend Maz, hi if you're watching, and well we plan on going out for drinks if she gets here in time so I thought I would show you my outfit because I wore it to work today, my top necklace and sort of jeans, jeggings I call them, um, but switched up the shoes and the jacket and amped up the makeup because I'm going out. So I'll start off with my makeup because I just got home from work and I put a lot more on. Um, so foundation is um, really nice actually. I'm really liking it. I've managed to, um, sorry I made my lighting go weird. I've managed to contract I think it's, con I don't know if it's contact dermatitis, but it's dermatitis on my chin, um, and it's from using bad products, but I won't go into that, um, and possibly my fluoride toothpaste, you know you get toothpaste on your chin, anyway my skin is so angry since having a Matigo and chicken pox and all that jazz, so I won't bore you with that, but the foundation that I use really covers it very well, so that's why I wanted to mention it, it's very buildable, um, and it is the MAC studio sculpt and I have it in NW30 I believe um, and I use that mixed with my strobe cream on a Real Techniques buffing brush. I then use the MAC Pro concealer uh, in NW, it's way lighter, I think it could be MW20 and I pop that under my eyes um, and sort of pull it down in that sort of motion to try and give me a bit of lift and light in the centre of my face. But as you can see, I still have dark bags, so don't know how well that works. To set, I used the Makeup Forever HD powder. I've got that off of my mum because she doesn't use it, and um, I love that powder. It's very fine milled, and it just works wonders. The only problem is, is that sometimes it can flash back on me. But hey, if I'm not getting photographed, I don't really mind. Um, to contour, I actually used Hoola from benefit today because I'm getting a bit paler um, now in as it heads into the winter time so I didn't want to go for such a warm uh, contour because I was in the summer using MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Give Me Sun so I contoured with Hoola uh, no blush today I just didn't fancy it but on my cheeks I have the um, Dior Amber Dylan highlight which I'm just getting back into and loving on my eyes I have um, Maybelline Bad to the Bronze as a base, then I popped on the brown, I believe it's called Fawn, in the Urban Decay Naked Basics palette. And I also popped the really white sort of um, highlighter in the centre of my eyes. My eyes are quite close set, so I really need something light and bright and glitzy in there to um, widen them. Uh, and then I put some of that Fawn underneath my eye and then I lined the inside and my top uh, lash line with Max Bronze. Oh no, sorry, Teddy. Teddy. Uh, through my eyebrows, I have the same Urban Decay colour. Um, yeah, sorry, my phone buzzed. And then I'm using, I just got it, which is the Maybelline Brow Drama Gel because I was finding that I would just be ghetto and use a uh, spoolie, a disposable one, spray my hairspray on the spoolie and rub through my eyebrows, rub through, brush through my eyebrows, but I really like the Maybelline dra Brow Drama um, in medium brown um, because it also gives them a bit of tint and makes them look more, like, brings the brow hairs out and makes them look more bushy, which I really enjoy. On my lips at the moment, I do not have, um, anything currently. I just had the Rimmel Lip Liner in Addiction. I've just lined my lips because I'm having a cup of tea. Um, so this is my tea. And I have the Celestials Fruit Tea Sampler in my San Francisco mug from Starbucks. Love Sam Brand. Jewels, I have uh, Swarovski Skirts as always, Engagement and Wedding Band. 
Um, and I've had a few questions on it. It is a uh, yellow diamond in the center and then white brilliant diamonds on half of the arm. They only go halfway around. Uh, the band is platinum and then my wedding band is alternate white and yellow diamonds and I don't know if you can see it very well um, but the band, I'll separate them, same um, platinum but the band is curved to fit around the um, main stone which makes it a lot more comfortable because it fits together really snugly all the way around so if you are getting married congratulations and that may be a good idea for you band wise um, and then one day I plan to have another bad boy on the top. Um, necklace is, I actually got it for my friend. She got it for me from Pakistan. So I can't tell you. Um, just to mark it in Pakistan. Uh, watch is the Michael Kors. Rose gold. 5314. This um, ring that I've got on is a mixture of... Um, silver and rose gold and that is from Coles and my bangle is a super super duper old one from Topshop. Um, this t-shirt is from Topshop. I got it relatively recently. It was £18. It's just my style of top. You know that I have this signature loose top. It's just super super duper comfortable. Um, it's jersey. It's like this. It's like a bat wing um, sort of scoop neck and uh, slouchy and that's just my favoured look because if I wear everything, I really like to wear skinny trousers and if I wear skinny trousers and a skinny top, I look like a beanpole. So I have to have a balance, either I'm wearing wide leg trousers and a bodycon, you know, a pencil skirt and a bodycon top, something like that. But uh, normally it's the other way around, normally it's a loose top and tight jeans. So I'll show you my tight jeans. They are... The, uh, the burgundy in colour, which I don't know how well you might be able to see there. They're burgundy. And they're the burgundy Lee jean. Like that. Um, and they are just skinny all the way down. What I have done, I've poked this down a bit, is tucked my top into the front so that it doesn't just look like a sack of potatoes. And then, um, oh yes, here we go turned my jeans up slightly at the bottom um yeah yeah so that you can see my shoesies and my shoes I've shown you before they're just the two strap that I'm in love with from Zara nude at the back white at the front and uh bag I'm going to be carrying is the Zara Black City which I just got out again which is freaking awesome. Um, uh, uh, jacket um, I'm gonna rock is probably my leather, um, black one from Zara. It's a good one. And um, lip, I'm just probably gonna put on L'Oreal Ferris Nude because it is my absolute fave at the most. And um, nails is OPI Private Jet. I don't know, there's a lot of chat about reformulations of it. I really have no clue. Oh my god, my hair's so frizzy. All I know is that I love OPO's My Private Jet. And... <sighs> fragrance is... Uh, I was reaching them for what I was going to say. Fragrance is the new one by Chloe. It is called Rose. Chloe de Rose, I believe. It's absolutely gorgeous. Chloe make the most divine smelling perfume so um i hope you enjoyed my outfit of the evening i'm sorry it was a long rambly one but i quite like when i just ramble i just chat i just like being myself i'm not too edited or cut or stylized and i hope you enjoy that also um and apologies for the lack of videos and now the sudden influx i uh had a cap on my upload um capabilities which i've never had and i don't suddenly know why virgin have suddenly put a cap on it um but then i had to pay more monthly to upgrade to a better package so that i could upload more videos and pictures to my blog so um i'm back in action i do like posting once a week on a sunday so that you guys know when to expect a video and i do apologize for i think it's now been three sundays without 
but to be able to, to have time off between 8 and 1 when Virgin Media can come round and fix this new cap that I suddenly have on my upload um, upload capabilities, uh, it's been very tricky. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I will be back to my regular um, Sunday night scheduling. I hope you enjoy the Sunday night scheduling. Let me know if you want me to change it to another day, time, etc. And I will try and fit that in for you guys. Um, and I've been blogging recently, so you can always check that out. My blog post, I mean, what? <laughs> my blog, L, is Elizabeth Camille Fisher .uk. All my Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook is Elizabeth One. And um, if you have any comments on what you would like to see next, please leave them below, and I'll speak to you guys in my next one. Bye.